All right, gamers. Could you imagine? Can you imagine if 420 corrupted gauntlet and three armor seeds to show? It's a good time. It's a good time. Oh, no way. No way. No way, bro! No way! Holy shit! Holy... Uh, give me five. I'll be right back. So... Sing a song for me. Yes, please. Bo. Voila! There it is. Hey, I got my fucking second Basilisk Jaw. Let's fucking go, dude. Let's go. Dude, that's 20 mil in the bank, bro. That's actually so sick. All right, ladies and germs. Um, we got the Enhanced Crystal Weapon Seed. Huge for the rebuild. Um... Yeah, so I mean, after five months and 1,054 KC, and obviously I went for the back-to-back, -back, no dice, never lucky, but yeah, we're going to do some housekeeping. I went ahead and cut all the gems, got to 90 crafting, which is pretty nice. Now we're going to go ahead and do Giant's Foundry till 83 smithing, that's the skill we're training, so that way we can do the Lumbi Elite and yeet the Draymond Staff. Um, I was thinking about maybe using some of this money for fletching or construction, but I do need 87 Slayer, so that's next after this. Anyway, we're going to keep grinding. We're going to get 83 smithing, and I'll keep you posted. Alright, just a little update here at almost 80 smithing. Um, what do I do for this method? Because so I buy... 16 mithril and 12 adamant plate bodies from the store here in Priff. I actually have my other account, my trading and banking account, um, sell plate bodies at the shop so I don't have to hop worlds. Even though if I if I had to hop worlds, I would only have to hop, I don't know, like four worlds, but it's easier this way. It just costs a bit of money. I mean, not a huge amount, but anyway, it's not terrible. So I got four swords here. You have to wear one plate body. Um, you make four swords, you teleport back to the Giant's Founder using the minigame teleport. I have my quest cape, uh, since I don't have a rune pouch. Teleport to a fairy ring with my Draymond staff, teleport to house, and repeat. So, yeah, I mean, at this point, I have, what? I mean, I have all the molds and now 6k reputation. I might be able to buy the full outfit here, but I'm going to wait until the very end to see where see where see where i'm at and we will make the determination as to what to buy because i kind of want this thing just to have so because you can rebuy this from purdue but anyway back to business and i don't know if i actually brought this one up but i am death banked right now so the only stuff i just keep the coins in my inventory and everything else i keep on me um, the Draymond Staff switches from my hands to my inventory once I drop some plate bodies into the Crucible over there because you can't have anything in your hands when you have this big old big sword here. So, anyway, in case you were wondering where all my stuff went or how exactly I'm doing it, Death Banking is very important to a lot of UIM skilling methods if you haven't had the pleasure of doing them yourself. And let me tell you, it's terrible. And it's not that bad. But if you die, you lose all your stuff. So that's terrible, though. That's pretty bad. We don't like that. All right. And with that, we have 84 smithing. We went one above. Figured I would get the whole smithing outfit here. 
Nice to have storable ice gloves, and also I can boost the diary step with a grog here. So we're gonna buy one. And we're gonna do that diary step right now. We did it. All right. Don't think I managed to record it, but we did finish up the Lumberge Elite Diary. So now we're just gonna get our last Slayer level for Trident and start doing some fun shit. And I'm very excited. Um, we have a Shaman's Task right now. So obviously we're whipping out the new bow must be much better than RCB with Broadbolts, but we will find out shortly. Um, I'll see you guys in like 20, 25 KC when I get the Warhammer. All right, right now we're on the tail end of a Gargoyles task into our 300th, so we're gonna go to Konar afterwards. Though, I think we're gonna grab an Ancient Staff from the Wildy, just to make any bursting task a little easier, because I did lose mine a while back, so. I think that's the next plan before task number 300. Ooh, and a hard clue. So I just got a second dragon pick. Um, what, nine KC on Calvarion? So, I mean, I already have one, but I think I'm just gonna drop it. Honestly, uh, over to the main that is. I mean, that's two mil. I mean, let's let's see what the stash is. Let me see what that requires, because I know there's also a stash unit. I'm gonna say no. I'm gonna say I'm dropping it over. I don't do master clues enough for it to be a big problem, and uh, quite frankly, it's not that hard to get a second one later. I'm sure I'll get plenty throughout my clay time. So, three GP for the main. All right, so we have been back at the Slayer grind. Um, I'm on the cusp as to whether or not I want to get a Master Wand for the Ancients casting, or if I'm just going to stick it out and do Calvarion. I mean, there's some good drops he has, but it's more uh, safe and easy to just get MTA. And I'm going to get a Kodai anyway, so I'm going to need it. But as it is, we are, I don't know, uh, about halfway through Slayer, this level that is, that ruins my recording. Oh, no. no. We don't go, okay. So, yeah, I'd say about halfway through this level, maybe 45%, and we are in Basilisks. Um, once we finish that up, we will do what we need to do, but if I do get a Bursting Task at any point, I will just make that decision. Maybe 10, 15, 20 Calvarion kills, and if no luck, then we're gonna go for the Master Wand. 147 Worms incoming. And what do we get? Black dragons, that's easy at least. Alright, I got steel dragons and skipped. And uh, we got our points back for free, basically. I don't want to do this task, but I'm going to do this task. I went to go do a clue scroll. And this guy was just sitting here, so enjoy. Enjoy. Dying on my hard cry, man. Completed. What a bastard. He probably thought I was going to the Chaos Altar. Oh well. And... Ooh. Do not like that. But I'm gonna do it for the Visage chance. Uh, did you guys know when you equip a, mi a Mind Shield, it makes this cool noise and animation? What? I never knew that. That's, uh... Yeah. All right, we got a hard clue on that task, and what do we get? Classic, classic hard clue. Love it. And... That sucks. But, Visage, so we're gonna do it. Abyssals or Black Demons, come on. We're skipping that, I don't like that. I hate that. Honestly, should block those. Black dragons? Ugh. Alright, get my points back, word. And we get Kurask. Hard casket. Typical. And... <laughs> you can't make this stuff up, man. Five minutes later... Bloodveld, just for the superior chance, we'll take it. It's not too bad of a task. And 
Nice. I'm going to melee these guys, but they drop good seeds. Um, we're going to do this clue scroll. So, BRB. All right, in the casket we get. Collection log slot completed. Sarah Fullhelm will take it. Uh, I don't know about this master, though. Yeah, I'm all good on that one. So, cool. Put it in the POH. So, I actually decided to burst these because uh, it's pretty much enough XP to get me to 87. So, we'll take it. We'll take it and go. I'm going to have to do like a few more monsters on the next task. And, and we're skipping for Trident. So, I'm very excited. And yes, I am manually casting this because I do not want to go to Calvaryon right now. After this grind, I think I'm done with Slayer for a little bit. So I'll get the either Master Wand or Ancient Scepter, Staff, whatever, when I go back to it. So, yep. So we did finish off a Totem last task. And let's see what we get. Off Skatizo here, our boy. All right, so after the world's longest death animation plays, we'll see what we get. Some good. Uh, I'll take the hard clue. That's cool. Level up and that's completed. 87 Slayer, baby. Congratulations. All right, ready for Kraken's first task? Nope, Hellhounds. Cancel the Hellhounds. Bro, I got Kraken's second task. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Easy, bro. Little update. We are a little over 300 cave Kraken. So I'm on my second task now. Still no luck, but it is what it is. And we're going to keep going. So. All right. So we got it. After two tentacles and 600 Kraken kills, we got the trident. Um... I've decided that now we are going to try and clear out some of the trash up in here. I had to cut these. These are from my CG grind. I have these, these, and these that can be used to make diamond bolt tips, but I'm going to get the rest of these bars from Zolra. This is for construction grind. This is for smithing to make these into darts from Zolra, or for Zolra, from the bulb blowpipe that I'll get. And uh, these are charged my trident. So we have a lot of room to make. Oh yeah, this is for, um, I have to finish my Calvarion grind. And I got these from him to make super energies. So I can make stamps eventually. But I teleported to the wrong place. And yeah, I'd like to make some space for some more PVM gear. And we're going to do that right now. I realized I casually did not mention the 60,000 arrow shafts I had. That is that way I can get... 99 fletching while doing 99 construction, so that's why that's there. Alright, we did a hard clue we got for that grind, and we get. Oh, yeah, I can't open it here. And we get. Collection log slot completed. Well, we'll take it, because eventually we can single store the Vandos plate body, which I had and then lost, um, to single store the BGS. So, we'll take it. It's not bad. Let's see. I just need the shield and the plate body back, and we're good. Alright, cool. Alright, so we got eight brimstone keys. Go ahead and open up here, and let's see what we get. We like that. We don't like that. Ooh. Ooh. Jeez. Uh, well, <laughs> that was garbage. <laughs> I hated that. All right. Well, whatever. All right. And I will be back with you guys in like 15 to 16 hours after cutting all these. So, yep. All right, uh, last inventory here of sapphires, and that took three hours, but 200,000, 223,000 crafting experience, actually. And what can we process next? Hmm. 
I'm thinking we go visit the ranging guild and see if we can't get lucky. I'm pretty sure that it's going to be empty because yesterday when I bought these, it was right after the update, but, and you know, it's worth the shot. All right, so we wound up doing some Calvarion and let's see if we get lucky. Looking for the ancient staff, looting. Guess we just get a looting bag. I think maybe because somebody tagged it, but anyway, this is what we're doing now. All right, we are officially at the drop rate for the Ancient Scepter and no dice yet, but we're gonna keep going. If I get a Void Waker piece, I will be kind of upset because that means I have to hold on to it and then grind out the whole thing and I wasn't planning on it, but boy, would I sure hate that. That would be the worst. Am I right, guys? Am I, am I right? And we got it, 57 KC. Let's go, I'm actually stoked about this one. Oh, it's very nice to have that one back. All right. Neck reels, all right, we're gonna melee these guys in the Slayer Tower for seeds. So yeah, that's gonna be cool. We're gonna love that. And what do we get? Nothing, sweet. Image. Easy. This is, dude, can't wait for this purple, bro. It's gonna be so sick. Nope, never lucky. Be for me. Really? Nice. Alright, kid, let's get that purr, bro. Of course not. Of course, dude. I had a two percent purple chance. Jeez, and a one fifty. I was the brawler, and you were the leech. How does it feel? How does it feel? I'm the. What's the brawler? Like most melee damage. Yep. How did I, bro? The kid with the whip out DPS the fang. What? All right, dude. This should be perfect. Zalk. Zalk. Please. And come on. There it is. We got it. <laughs> I'm stoked. And 500 law runes. I'll actually take 500 law runes. The only law rune I'll keep or rune. Hell yeah. Oh, did that kid TP out? Yeah, they have to be in one trip. So he's fucked. Combat task completed. I'm stoked about that, dude. Let's go. And blue skipped. Blue skipped, indeed. And what do we get instead? Oh, that's rough. This is rough, guys. want to but I'm gonna and clue collection log slot oh. completed that's actually dope oh my god that's so sick we're keeping that one in the bag for a while god fucking damn it this game's a scam you tell me with a 2% purple chance I'm not getting purples 2.75% chance you can suck my dick <sighs> and I took more damage this time. Damn, I'm actually the leech. Hold on, leech. What do I get? Seeds. Oh! <gasps> Snapdragon, six of them. Let's go! Torsals can hit the fucking trash, but snaps? We love snaps. All right, so... Did some raids earlier. Figured I might mess around and try and get a cheeky Zenite or two. Kinda want them for uh, Zora and God, Zora and God Wars. If I could speak, jeez. But this ain't that bad. I expected it to be far worse. So this is this is fine. Got a nice meaty task here. And yeah, we will see if we get lucky and get one or two. Hopefully two. Want the anguish and suffering. So. Yeah, we'll take whatever we can get. 
Javelin shaft. That was one of those bad boys. Jeez. Alright. Back to it. Alright, and of course I missed the drop. I was, uh... I didn't want to risk dying there. I had no food in my envy. Literally just got it until it out, but... Bada bing, bada boom. Let's take a quick look here. Oh my god, it, this this plugin keeps resetting the collection log plugin. It's uh, super cool, but what is that other? Gloss experiments, 25, and we got one. You love to see that. All right, I mean, I guess I, I could just sell this stack of chaos runes that I have and make my anguish, which uh, I think that'd be helpful. I think we're going to do that. I think we're gonna do that right now. Um, do I finish the task first? Cause I'm gonna have to boost some, no, cause the suffering I will not have to boost for. Cause I have 90 crafting, if I could find it right here. 90, 92 for the uh, anguish. So I'll do the thing I have to boost for now. And uh, yeah, cool. And here we are making the uncut onyx. Bam, cut that little bad boy. Let's get making that necklace. Please cook, please do not burn, please, 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 yes. Actually, I don't even know if you can burn pies. Let's look that up. Oh, you can definitely just use the cook pie lunar spell. It takes forever to get these fucking crafting boost things. So whatever, whatever, we got it. It's all that matters. We got it, guys, we got it. And there you go. There it is. Already had it marked from playing my other account. That is beautiful. You love to see this. All right, back to the old grind. Cheeky little hard clue. Oh, can't. Cheeky hard clue? What? <laughs> I already have the nunchucks. They're worth like 4K. Oh man, worthless. At least that looked good. All right, with that task completed, we did get two whole Z Knights and a Ballista Spring. Keeping that for the meme. Um, use like 2k charges or something. 20, 20. Oh. <laughs> Hope we get some burst tasks in the catacombs because that eight. I think it was like maybe 10 charges per kill on average then because <laughs> I did 250 but hey you know one more Z9 we're good so let's go process this I unfortunately have to go buy 20,000 chaos runes so really looking forward to that and then a hard clue what do you think I get in this casket pretty close pretty close another one in the books Never lucky, dude. I'm consistently think... just under 10k damage. Maybe if you did more damage and uh, took less damage. Yeah. Dude, this is the most goaded fucking loot of all time. 150 dragon dart tips, 3 D meds, and 6 snaps. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> just got 10 Raynar seeds, 183 dark tips, and 16 Zavis stabs. It's 650k. Okay, and to close off this episode, I am getting 99 construction. Um, it's been fun. I am 89, just got 89 actually, and it's going to be a long, long grind, but I think this construction cape is going to be very helpful. I'm not actually going for 99 fletching, I'm just using what I got, which wound up being around 270k arrow shafts. Um, so a decent chunk of fletching, but obviously not 99. Um, yeah, so after this, we're going to be doing some Zolra, some God Wars, some raids, a lot of, a lot of grinds, a lot of uh, bossing. I just wanted to get rid of some of the stuff in my looting bag and... Some of the other stuff that needs to get processed is I have gold ore and rune ore and bars. So 
we're gonna get up to 89 smithing um, after this construction grind and then I think the bag will be clear enough to actually do fun stuff um, I might be doing herb lore but I'm actually not too sure about that one yet I might wait for more seeds because I have about one level banked in my bag with all my seeds um, and I don't want to devote a lot of bag space to them because I'm already kind of low that's why I did this in the first place we got to clear some stuff out so um, on top of that we are going to be going for blood bark and what was the other thing blood bark and we need to get the spined armor so we can single store the whip so those are two little mini grinds a lot of fun stuff to look forward to and I'm glad you guys don't have to do this mahogany homes as I do um, currently I have 1878 contracts so thank you for watching and you have a good day